NBC News. This is Today with Bryce Gumbel and Catherine Couric. Our science correspondent Bob Bazell this week is looking at the growing popularity of alternative medicine. And this morning, he tells us what the AMA is learning from it. Bob, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Bob. It's not just the AMA, but it's all of organized medicine. For a long time, most of it ridiculed alternative treatments. But as so-called holistic therapies have become more and more popular, some people in science-based medicine have begun to realize that the interest in these treatments may be telling them what they are lacking and how they might improve. of Louisville in Kentucky. These people are practicing an ancient technique called toning, which some people believe helps to calm and relax the mind, the body, and the spirit. This is one example of how techniques and treatments that some believe might be relegated to the fringes of unconventional treatment programs are making their way into established institutions. I think there's always the fear that this is something new age and, uh, you know, weird and that you have to be out on a limb, you have to go out on a limb in order to really benefit. And the fact is, it's as ancient as anything we know about. It.